autonomous driving as we envision it is really uh, manifold because you can today already some cars have some autonomy for example when you want to park we are already experimenting and testing cars which are able to really go and by themselves go to the parking lot so to a certain extent it's a service like a wallet service valid service you say and uh, we also have in, envisioned the possibility of course to let the car move by itself in the traffic jams till for example 30 kilometers per hour and extendedly we can also uh, have cars driving at normal speed in streets and also on highways so by doing that in an absolutely safe environment and at affordable costs then this service can be extremely useful for a lot of people and in fact for everybody Breakfasts in terms of innovation are not supposed to be disclosed, <laughs> obviously. But at least we can say which are the key domains into which uh, this uh, extended collaboration uh, will, will take place. And for sure we should not forget powertrain. Powertrain for fuel efficiency, to reduce emissions. Of course the ultimate is EV and even in EV there is a lot of progress we can make. Uh, and which are be taking place at the moment and being prepared. That's the first one. The second one is lightweight and lightweight material for the sake also of uh, fuel efficiency and of course of uh, lower emissions, but also for the sake of uh, handling and driving dynamism. That's the second point. The third point is clearly connected car with all the expected new services that the customer will express more and more in the future and it is clear that the creativity of the connected car you know and services paid and being developed you know uh, that you can find on your smartphone or tablet for example is absolutely enormous and last but not least is of course all which is connected to active safety and the autonomous car i would say first uh, extended number of uh, customers because needs in mobility are really not yet satisfied in many areas, many countries in, in the world. Uh, that's the first point. Safe, extremely safe, clean, efficient, individual mobility, but also shared mobility in a chosen manner. Um, but at the end of it, I would say, uh, of course, uh, a new driving experience that high and hyper connectivity plus autonomous driving is going to bring to our customers and this is what we are preparing at the moment.